Got another question on the enthalpy and entropy topic. So this one concentrates on enthalpy. As usual, the link to the questions in the description of the video if you wanted to try it first. So definition for the term lattice enthalpy, the enthalpy change when one mole of an ionic lattice is formed from its gaseous ions. Moving on to part B. So if we think about the positive ions first in these two compounds, we've got the Mg2+, plus, which has a greater charge and a smaller ionic radius than Na+. Plus. And then if we think about the negative ions, the Cl- minus ion has got the smaller ionic radius than the Br-. minus. So it's difficult to predict the lattice enthalpy because magnesium 2 plus has the greater attraction of the positive ions, but Cl minus has the greater attraction of the negative ions. Moving on to the born harbour cycle, I've put the elements in straight away. They would live on that line there. Just remember, bromine's a liquid under standard conditions. So this here, elements to the compound, the solid ionic lattice, that's the enthalpy change of formation which is F. So we're told from the table here that this process is A, so that's the atomization of magnesium. So we're changing this solid magnesium into a gaseous atom. Process D now, so that is the atomization of bromine. So we're gonna generate two gaseous bromine atoms here. Obviously we'll have the Mg gas as well. So the next thing we've gotta do is ionize the magnesium. So first and second ionization energies. So that's steps B and C, and obviously there's the species that you need on that line there. Don't forget that electron. And finally, we've got to turn these two gaseous bromine atoms into two gaseous bromide ions. So that's the first electron affinity of bromine, which is process E. And finally, the calculation. You can see I've put in all the enthalpy change values. So just talk about a couple of them. This one here is the atomization of bromine. You can see we've got, we're generating two gaseous bromine atoms so we have to double that one and we're generating two gaseous bromide ions here so we need to double that one and then just quickly Hess's law so this route here from the element to the solid lattice so the enthalpy change for that route is minus 524 Hess's law says that this will equal that so all we need to do is put the numbers in and solve for x and the lattice enthalpy comes out at minus 2433 kilojoules per mole.